Okay, Sheriff. I'll pay the damages. All right. You boys see to it that you stay out of trouble. You hear? Uh, why'd you pay for us? Well, I got reasons of my own. Why don't we go over the saloon and talk about it? Sounds like good to me. to do, just clean that black off that piece of land and you get a hundred dollars. Now, you can start by stealing these horses. That ought to cause him plenty of trouble. Well, that'll be the easiest hundred dollars I ever earned. Me too. Likewise. <laughs>
Well, looks like you boys got the job done, so here's your money. I figure you owe me some money for the horses. Some people ain't got sense enough to die when it's a poster. Maybe he's really dead and that ain't him standing here. Ain't but one way to find out. about two years for shooting up your place and trying to rob you, Frank. The circuit judge is over at Boulder Pass. We'll have to deliver him over there at the stand trial. Thanks, Sheriff. I'm sure justice will be done. Got another passenger for you, Jake. Got there, Pete. They'll pick him up at Boulder Pass. Who is he? I, I shot up a couple of people trying to rob old Frank here. Well, we'll, uh, we'll take good care of him. See that you do. Okay, let's go. Hit him, please go. Help! Thank you. I might even go around again. Excuse me. You're excused. I don't think you should be talking to this man. Why not? Because he's a criminal, that's why. You don't look much like a criminal to me. Can't you see his handcuffs? You see a man with handcuffs figuring right off, don't you? I is the robber, and you is the robbie. Now, chuck down that hardware, and let's get on with it. Come on, folks. Get out of there. Lord of mercy. <laughs> What's your problem, boy? This is my problem. And I ain't your boy. What'd you do, rob or kill somebody? Be a lot easier to talk with these off. You heard the man. Help him off with that. And while that's going on, the rest of you nice folks, fill those bags up with your belongings. Be quick about it, please. Don't worry, come on, give it up, give it up. No, ma'am, you keep yours. Maybe I'll see you in Albuquerque. All right, get back on board. <laughs> come on, move it, fella. Hope y'all ain't late. Now get out of here. Wants to thank you for saving my life. You're welcome. How about handing me them saddlebags, huh? <laughs> oh, yeah. Yeah, sure. Thank you. Well, <laughs> I guess I'll be seeing you. 
Well, you can't leave me out here. Well, why not? I didn't bring you out here. Because it ain't human. That's why it ain't human. Yeah, you're right. But my horse don't like to ride double. Adios, amigo. You got in those bags, senor. Nice of you to bring us these fine gifts. Do you have any last words before we kill you, senor? Help. Figure we 
even now, huh? Well, don't be mad at me, boy. I just made us three thousand dollars. You mean you made us three thousand dollars? How you make us three thousand yeah. dollars? Twenty dollars, huh? Go ahead and throw. Hey, that's not a bad throw. Twenty dollars says you can't beat Frenchie. Plus twenty in the night. <laughs> Twenty dollars, my friends. Twenty dollars. Howdy. Can I have a whiskey, please. Never touch my money. That was pretty good. <laughs> yes, sir. Oh. <coughs> Think you can do any better? <laughs> Give it a try. <laughs> well, you need more than a knife. Out here, you need a gun. Them notches. Oh, these notches? That's for all the men like you who uh, thought their gun was faster than my knife. I wasn't speaking about me. I was talking about my amigo. He's so fast, you can't even see him draw. That fast, huh? That's right. Where is this uh, hombre? He'll be along any minute now. There he is now. What the hell you mean leaving me back there like that, Sam? I was almost beat to death. I'm glad to see you, boy. I figure you owe me some money. Of course I do. Why don't we go over to the bar and have a drink, amigo? <laughs> Take it easy. <laughs> you know something? I wish you stopped calling me amigo, because every time you do, that means trouble for me. So this is your amigo, huh? I want the gun so fast you can't see it move. Hey, who is this? <laughs> no, I don't think he's that fast. In fact, I don't think he's ever used that gun. <laughs> don't make him mad. I'm telling you, watch out with that thing. I told you, don't make him mad. He'll kill you for sure. Kill who? What you talking about, sir? Ooh-wee. You getting mad? Uh-oh. Watch out, everybody. Back off. Big Ben's mad. This is something else. About time you're getting mad. Goodness gracious. Yeah, I'm getting mad. Can you really Roll. use that thing? Hey. Yeah, put I can your money it. in the hat. I know how you got them notches on that knife. Picking on people that scared of you. You talk too much, friend. Yeah, you sure do. Put the money in the hat. Just put it down here. 
Take your gun out. Stand up. Stand up. Turn around. Stay and have supper with us. Sure would be nice. Ain't seen one like him come through here in a long time. Spirited young lady. Hey, Sam. Huh? You a gambling man by the chance? Well, I don't do no serious gambling. <laughs> 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 I do play a friendly game of cards every now and then. <laughs> well, I'll tell you, I ain't uh, much of a poker player, but if it's a friendly game, I guess it couldn't hurt nothing, huh? 
Good Lord. Really? <laughs> Excuse my hand. Don't be it too high in Hollywood, brother. I'm just a small man. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, but I spied you for a flick the first time I saw you. <laughs> Have you ever in your life seen a more honest face than mine? Mm. In all your born days? <laughs> <laughs> I, I, I bet you three dollars. Three dollars? <clears throat> I think you're bluffing. So. I'm going to raise you five dollars. But I'll see you five, and I'll raise you ten. <laughs> Just ten and ten more. But I'll call you. What you got? Four queens. <laughs> Oh, that's a great hand. Four queens. <laughs> I got four kings. <laughs> Give me the card, boy. <laughs> Keep your eyes on the cards, boy. My right eye fends thee. I'll pluck it out. Four kings. Four ways. You ain't checking out already, are you? Noah? I'll be right back. Mighty hot out here. Yeah. Softly. Warm? For this time of year? Turned you from a pigeon into a big fish. Mm. Now you know what I'm gonna do? I'm gonna wheel you in. <laughs> so you watch out, you gonna wheel in a shark. <laughs> That's a joke, boy. <laughs> okay, okay. <laughs> Who you think you playing with anyway? You ain't even dry behind the hill yet. $100. And I'll raise you 200 Well, I'll see you 200 And I'll raise you another 100 You 100 And 600 more. Well, I'll call you 600 What you got, old man? Four aces. Thank <laughs> you.
Can I help you, stranger? Yes, uh, sure hope so. Kind of looking for some work. Look like you need help there. You're mighty right there, stranger. Uh, I'm getting too old for this kind of work. Look like you got yourself a job. Thank you. What you staring at? You. Don't you just go and stare somewhere else, huh? Can't you see I'm busy? You wanted by the law. I once knew a man wanted by the law, and my papa shot him. Collected the reward. You got a reward? Well, if there was, I sure wouldn't be telling you. What's your name? Mine's Mary. Think Mary's a pretty name? I'm told it's a pretty name. Yeah, yeah, Mary's a pretty name, huh? Now, just go away. A lot of men here about tell me I'm pretty. Think I'm pretty? Yeah, I think you're pretty. Uh, 
Oh, baby. Who's he? He's a new hired man. Pa just hired him. What are you doing talking to him? Ain't you know no... I don't like you talking to other men. Ain't no harm in just talking. You stay away from him. Hey, you. Me? Yeah, you. This here is my woman. Don't let me catch you looking at her again. Yes, sir. That's fine with me. Look, honey, I'm going to be a little late to the dance tonight. Me and the boys got some fences to mend up on the north pasture. So I guess I'll have to meet you there. It's OK, Bill. I'll get there. Pretty hard me fellow, ain't he? I like him, ornery. the last of it, sir. Damn this tire. Never could tire one of these things. Well, maybe I can help you. Come on, Pa. I don't want to be late to the picnic. Why don't you let the new hand drive me? Uh, uh, no, sir. You sound kind of tired all that wood there. Make him, Pa. He ain't that tired. You'll learn, young man, that Mary always gets her way. Look like you're going to have to put off your rest for a spell. Go on, do like she says. It ain't very far. Shot a snake. Killed it hard. Died a lizard. 
Rolled over and sat. There was an old boy named Dallas from a slave ship. He came. Lord, my shame, my best. I see myself in a mirror. Visions and the horror. Me there. Tomorrow, I'll see you. But my darling, don't foster. No, I leave this from nowhere. No people. Just what do you think you're doing here? What's it look like I'm doing here? I'm stealing rocks. Well, this happens to be my father's land. And if he were here, he wouldn't like it. Well, and you sure wouldn't be talking to me the way you're talking to me right now. Well, look, he ain't here. And I'm gonna talk to you that way. You just get on away from me, little lady. Go ahead, get. Ain't you never seen a crazy man? <laughs> get myself out of here now. For sure. Nice day. Um, the lady and gentleman over there, who's that? Oh, you mean those two people walking there? Yeah, yeah that, that's the mayor and his daughter. The mayor and his daughter? <laughs> Thank you kindly. Help you. Uh, yes, uh, would you tell the mayor that I'm here to see him, please? Oh, one moment, please. I'll see if he's busy. Who may I ask is calling? Mr. Spade. Okay, he'll see you now. Thank you very much. Come in. Yes, sir, young man. What can I do for you? Well, I certainly hope you can help me, because I've traveled an awful long way to do business with you, sir. Have a seat, sir. Oh, thank you. Thank you very much. I, I represent some people that are land agents, and we're interested in a piece of property. We want to make an offer, and it's uh, land over by General Store. It's not of much value to you, I know that, but my people are interested in building an establishment there, see? And uh, it could benefit the whole town. Yes, sir, that does sound interesting. I'll discuss it with the town committee tonight. I should have an answer for you in the morning. It's a pleasure to do business with you, sir. 
Glad you came in. I hope something works out. <laughs> what did he want? It seems the town is coming into good fortune. you hold this, please? Hold this for me. Thank you, thank you. Just swing it like that. Let it swing. Thank you. Don't move. Just hold it like that. Oh, that's fine. That's fine. That's real fine. Thank you, ma'am. Thank you. Thank you very much. Thank you very much. Let's see. One. Do it. Two, three. No, that a measure too. Have you ever seen anything like it? No, no. Nothing like it in the world. But we can do it. Yeah, that ought to get it. Yeah, that's getting it. It's getting better. Here it goes. There it is. Just the way I want it. Yeah. Looks good, real good. Let me see. Well, we're set now. Really set now. I could. Could you stoop down just a little? Just a little, real slow. Yeah. Excuse me. Hold it. Hold it right there. Thank you, my. So. You're the one that's going to swindle this town, are you? I've got a good mind to run you in. Oh, don't do that, please. Only reason I didn't tell you the railroad was coming through because the mayor, he gave me a thousand dollars to keep it quiet. The mayor? A thousand dollars? Hmm. How much do you think this land is worth? <sighs> well, I, I would say about seventy thousand dollars. Seventy. That's a low estimate. <clears throat> you know, if uh, you can keep this between you and me, it could mean a lot of money for you. I couldn't do that. See, that's illegal. That's illegal. Why don't you just uh, follow me to my office around the corner, and it may be that I can match what the mayor offered. I ain't seen nothing, ain't heard nothing, and ain't gonna do nothing till I see you. You can get up now. Hmm. A land buyer, huh? Yeah. You sure didn't look like that the last time I saw you. You didn't look like that the last time I saw you. Just getting on my nerves. I'm a busy man. Where'd you get them clothes? Where'd you get them clothes? They ain't so hot. I'll tell you one thing. You don't know when a man's busy and when he ain't. And that's the thing women got to learn out here in these parts, because it's hard and it's rough. And a man don't need a woman to bother him. Ain't that right? It's a job to be done. This is a great country. Well, as far as the eye can see, there ain't nothing but country. And someday, it's gonna be more country. Because that's the kind of guy I am, a country guy. Ain't that right? <laughs> yeah, sir. Well, the land's not valuable, huh? <clears throat> Trying to swindle the town is a very serious offense. I understand how you feel now, Mayor. But Mr. Cross, the real estate agent, he gave me $1,000 to keep this secret. 
thousand dollars, eh? Uh, well, listen, young man, you come by my office. Maybe we can work something out. But not a word to anyone. My lips are sealed. It's a nice day, isn't it? It's a day, all right. You're the quietest people I ever met. I've been to a lot of towns that usually say something. But you're all right quiet. That's because you're business folks. You take care of your own business, and you mind your own way. Adios, amigos. A friend indeed is a friend indeed, my daddy used to say. But every time we look for one thing, look the other way. Now, I've been on the move for years, and let me tell you, Jack, a friend is friendly face to face, but an enemy back to back. Than your buddy or your pal, but never ask him to protect your money or your gal. Share and share a life with him, but when he's off alone, never trust them with foot. To see the look on the man's face yeah. when he found out he'd been swindled. <laughs> and you say it was a black? <laughs> yeah, black. Oh, but sharp as a whip. You know, I reckon he'd be white by the time he gets out of that jail. <laughs> <laughs> Sam. Sam. Howdy, amigo. Amigo? Some kind of amigo you are. I ought to let you right in there. After all we've been through together? You mean after all I've been through? Where's the sheriff of this place? He's out front. He's sleeping. Well, I'll see if I can get you out of here. Don't you go nowhere. Don't go nowhere. I'm going back to sleep. <clears throat> Wake up for breakfast.
down, ladies. Sit down. Sit down. We need some glasses. My name is Juanita. 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 My Juan name is Teresa. Teresa. I am Popeo. Oh, you are mucho hombre. Hey, mucho, mucho. <laughs> mucho. Don't touch the hair roll. <laughs> oh, but I like it. Mm. Super strong. Hmm? Get yourself a sheep if you like it. Me too. Oh, I got a great idea. The guy has a great idea. <clears throat> Ladies, I'm going to present myself to <laughs> you. Follow me. No more. I don't find it too healthy. Mm -hmm. Hello, amigo. Where's my share of money, huh? All over the place. <laughs> Ooh. I nearly got myself killed for that money. Where's my share? Help yourself. This side, this time, please. <laughs> My friend, ladies. This is Ben. Ben? My, my amigo. Ben, my amigo. I'm Ben. I was kicked by a horse you once. Are you right, Oh, sure. Oh, gosh. I'm fine. You got a nice soft coat. Oh, I think you better sit. Thank you. Mm. Let me have a drink. Ben, you know what? <laughs> We've been through a lot together. Yeah, I sure have, Sam. <laughs> Just to you and my money. <laughs> Woo! I have had this much. All right. Mm -hmm. You'll make it all better. on out of that wagon there. Come on, get him out of the wagon and let's go. Now, come on, we'll put you to work. That's right, come on, get on over there. Get your butt on over there.
in there, Sam. You must have held a fight. No talk, no talk. Here. Long as you men work hard, we treat you fair. Try to escape, we shoot you. Put them in a check and chain them up. Trying to get started more trouble. Trouble you know what I'm after. Tomorrow we gotta find a way to get out of this place. Find a way to get out. Did you see that big fat safe down there just ripe and ready for plucking? How you gonna pluck a safe with them chains on your arm? Chains? Why? Well, you don't know me, man. I'm a man with a big future. But ain't one chain gonna stand in my way. Yes, sir. You can't keep a good man down. No, I've been called a lot of names. Bar most of them. All right, boy. Your job will be to carry the water pail. I sure do appreciate that, sir. I couldn't break up none of them big rocks. I got a bad back. It killed me. You. Yeah. Got a special job for you. Got some big rocks need busting up down here. Let's go. Move. Come on. I sure do appreciate that job you gave me. I ain't breaking up them rocks and stuff. That killed me, you know that? But I just wish I could do something more, more helpful. Like when I was on the plantation, I used to clean the master's place real spotless every day. Well, that old waffle shack is sure enough to use the cleaning. Let's get it. I'm gonna do a good job too, Captain. You just watch and see. All right. About another six months, we should move to another mine. Sure beats keeping the money in any bank. A person has to be crazy to come here. True. Who would rob us? Hi. What you want, boy? I, I was the one coming here to clean up, sir. Ain't you one of those new boys that uh, beat up on some of my men in the cantina? No, sir, that wasn't me. Uh-uh. That was that big fella out there. He the troublemaker. I worked for him, see? He make me wash and do his cooking. He a mean one. A few days here will take the meanness out of him. <laughs> <laughs> he could use it. <laughs> I just go about my business here. <laughs> Lord of mercy, look what I found. <laughs> Excuse me, sir. I got to go get some dusting equipment so I can fix it up real nice for you. Yeah. <laughs> I'll be back. Uh, 
right, work day's over. It's over. Good night, y'all. Have a good night here. Make of it, Jed. Don't know. Might be trouble. Let's not take any chances. Yeah, get up, oh. Saint Negro. Get up. to do that. You don't mind if I buy your horse for a spell, do you? Come back here.
Why don't you go find your own road? Get away from me. You, they won't. Be my pleasure, boy. I'm tired of riding anyway. Adios, amigo. Hey, stop calling me amigo. I ain't your amigo. You come with me, no? I guess that's yes to both of you. Finally. Vamos. Vamos. Finally. Vamos. What do you mean, wait? You come inside, I'll show you. Oh, no, not again. How do you, amigo? We talk much to your amigo. The money from the mine. This is all we want, he says. You have it. Me? I've never seen it. He's got it. We have a problem here, don't we? You don't got it. He got it. You don't got it. You got it. I can't kill both of you. Oh, wait a minute. I, I said I don't have the money here. I didn't say I didn't know where it was. Good. Now we go somewhere. Yeah, we go somewhere. I get on my horse, I go get the money and come back. <laughs> you go. Come back. Yeah. Kill him. Oh, hold it. Hold it. No, no, no. I think you misunderstand my plan, see? I go, I leave my amigo here. If I don't come back, you kill him. Hey, now, wait a minute. You keep quiet. I don't like that idea. I go get the money, you kill him. You know where the money is? No, but if you give me... Here, shut up, or I'll kill you. You come back by nightfall, or your friend dies. To you. Where are you home? A gringo. I'll kill him if I see him again. Pretty soon we'll be rich. I'll buy anything you want. 
the answer is still no. Ah! I will kill you myself, amigo. I wish people would stop calling me amigo. It always means that something bad is about to happen. The night has come, amigo. And your friend is not here. Pancho, to the prisoner outside. You last wish, senor. Not to be here. Then I can grant you, amigo. How about a kiss for my uh, executioner? No, I will not. Woman, you will not grant a dying man his last wish? Good morning. You take it. Put it away. You heck have you heard, amigo? Now, we should celebrate. Música, muchachos. Que viva la fiesta. Y a gozar Amigo. 
Well, now, I sure as hell will have to be your enemy if you treat your friends the way you treat me. Now, just throw that money over here. You gonna miss me? Yeah. Sure, adios, amigo. Adios, amigo. Adios. <laughs> Adiós, amigo. Adiós, amigo. Look what we got here, Hoss. You're gonna need more than that. What do you mean? Just mount up. I'll show you. <laughs> You're going to be. They either want you, me, or the money. You ain't thinking of nothing crazy now, are you? Thinking about my future. All right, Sam, let's go. when they find out they ain't got nothing but Confederate bills. <laughs> Adios, amigo! Adios, uh, Confederate, what? Hey, 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 Sam, hey! Hey, that's my future, Sam! Sam, come back here! Hey, Sam, wait! Thank <laughs> you. 